we came here by buses uh, my whole company came by three buses it took a while actually because it's a long way from where we are stationed to here uh, the our vehicles Humvees and, and armored personnel carriers they were brought a bit earlier here so we when we came here they were already here and just waiting for us to mount up yes it was easy to get here and uh, the logistics are good uh, we don't have uh, logistical prob problems uh, we communicate really well we got here on time everything was ready for us so I think we executed it really well living conditions uh, to compare with the environment we are working on and the training uh, size uh, is good as well everybody has the bed all necessary stuff living condition is also nice uh, we have convenient tents and uh, show showers toilets what I really like and my guys also like the beds and uh, there's a mattress on the bed and the pillow and it's like really really nice well Polish army uh, did a great stuff for us this is the most comfortable tents uh, with heat uh, beds were prepared mattresses which we never seen before pillows uh, and all this stuff is really comfortable sir myself and uh, my soldiers uh, we are pretty satisfied with the food food is uh, enough it covers all necessary requirements food is good uh, food schedule was awesome uh, the menu was delicious like yeah, everybody in like US Army at least is uh, satisfied this is the best meals which were produced to us at any field exercise we've been so far food is very nice well the food is really nice actually we have three meals of hot uh, food per day also what I like the best is the hot tea or beverage we have and you can drink as much as you can and in this cold weather is really really good uh, no sore throats or coughs or any diseases um, the food is also nice we had some I guess Polish kind of you know like meat wrapped in cabbage uh, from what I heard it's Polish and we have back in Lithuania as well so it was really nice felt like home actually we started uh, before uh, the huge exercise which was led by the NATO in Poland, it was in 2002, uh, the, the exercise was called uh, the Strong Resolve. So we, so we had to prepare some structure in Poland and involve some ministries, etc. to force uh, supporting the unit on the ground. During the setup, the setup phase, so we we had uh, almost uh, 400 people involved in the setup uh, setup phase. We delivered uh, almost above uh, 1,000 breads uh, every day and 6,000 uh, meals per day for everybody, of course, for for foreigners and for our our forces. Uh, what's more, the the our meal uh, includes uh, four. 1050 100 calories oh that's the point it's a very 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 important uh, issue for the soldier on the ground <clears throat> what's more uh, 10 10000 liter uh, fuel we delivered to the to the french guy and the US, and the us guy for their for their equipment we discuss about the refueling it's, uh, i think it's okay for me hardest um, problem f from from our perspective is is a uh, Coordinate, movement coordination. That's we um, we need the proper date and proper um, manning for in, in included in the, in a DDP, so detailed deployment plan. So uh, that was a, a a great huge huge uh, challenge for us to to catch everything. And and what's uh, what's is most important for us is that now we know that we, we can do it again. I would rate it definitely five. Uh, five plus. Four. I would definitely uh, grade it as six, even on scale from one to five, sir. <laughs>